Amy Badnock is the new Tory leader, and I'll be honest, I'm surprised she won. Tories are notoriously racist when it comes to their leaders, and the fact Sunak didn't beat Truss was kind of the writing on the wall for that, because uh, Sunak was the obvious choice, and they elected Truss, and then she destroyed the economy for God knows how long, and then they just had to accept Sunak, because they were like, well, I guess there's no one else. So the fact that they elected Badnock is surprising, but also... Good that Jenrick was going to get in, because Jenrick went off the deep end, and I think he lost because he went off the deep end. He was going too far with some of his rhetoric, trying to appeal to the reform crowd, when he had to appeal to Tories, and there are still some middle-ish Tories who probably were like, that's weird, that's that's strange, why are you saying those things, Robert? Kevin Bednock being uh, chosen as the Tory leader is... <laughs> Definitely going to be the fall person. Uh, they're not going to win the next election. They might make up some ground, but they won't win. They might actually lose a bunch of people who they thought they'd try and capture by appealing to reform. Because again, reform voters, kind of racist. I don't really see them voting for a black woman. I don't know. Maybe they will. But I'm not sure when their option is Nigel Farage and for some reason they worship him. So I don't think I'm going to recapture the reform voters, even though Kim Bednock is more right-wing than, like, Rishi Sunak. Again, on, like, a social policy thing, which is kind of all they were running on. They were both running on just this um, culture war bullshit. Uh, Kim Bednock, anti-trans, anti-maternity leave, uh, which is strange. Anti- I'm not 100% sure on abortions, but uh, anti-trans, anti- immigration, anti-Palestine, uh, anti-autism for some reason, that's kind of strange, anti-ADHD, again, kind of a weird stance to have, so it's 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 seemingly going to be the same thing that South Asians faced for black people, it's going to be uh, that line, black faces in high places aren't going to save us, and if anything, it might bring up some stigma against black people, uh, just like stigma against brown people was raised because of Rishi Sunak and Priti Patel. So, not going to win, and it just shows the Tories have decided, let's go right wing and focus on a culture war instead of policies, so...